YouTube, how's it going? Donovan here, executive producer for Honest Ball Reviews. Uh, you never seen me on camera before. I'm always behind. But remember, be bringing you a vlog from the Masters this week, and uh, hope you like it. Yo, what's up, YouTube? We're just landed in Vegas. Uh, it's about midnight right now, heading over to our hotel. And uh, yeah, it's been a couple days since we checked in, so just want to let you know where we're at. Yo, what's up guys? It's uh, Wednesday now, it's about 8 a.m. Just woke up early, I'm on C-Squad, but we're gonna head over to the venue and we're gonna check out some of our fellow Colorado bowlers and maybe give you an insight. Practice was yesterday, feel like we went okay, so we'll just have to see where this week goes. Catch you in a little bit. All right, guys. We just got done with a squad here at the Masters. Uh, Chris, La Welcome. come on, Chris Lawson here. He had a pretty good day. He's 111 over. Uh, let's see, what were your thoughts on the day? How'd you do? I left a little bit out there. All right. Uh, they could always move from closer. The mid lanes were a little squirrely, if you will. All right. So there. But overall, it's a really good day. Uh, what balls did you use to get uh, the day? An idle pin up, and then a pin to the side, both of the fillet. Awesome, awesome. And you said you left a few out there, missed a few spares? Just a couple. Just a couple? Yeah. All right. Two, missed two makeables and two splits, but easy corrections. All right, perfect. Well, that's uh, after A squad. We'll see if we got anybody on B squad, and we'll check with you guys later. All right, guys, day one of the Masters is over. Um, did not perform how we should have. Uh, we had some good Colorado bowlers, though. Uh, Chris Lawson went 111 over. He's probably sitting somewhere around the top 10. Uh, me personally, I did not do well. I'm 100 or 200-ish under. Uh, just did not execute any shots, and you can't do that when it's such a hard pattern. Definitely missed a, t a lot of pins, um, mostly splits, but there's definitely about five to 10 makeables that I easily should have covered and didn't. And it cost me a lot of pins, but you know what? There's two more days left, so you never know what can happen, right? Two days. Two amazing days, and we'll just see what happens, right? All right, we'll uh, catch you guys tomorrow. Yo, what's up guys? Day two's over. Um, didn't film anything today just because it was a long day in mid-block. I was middle block and it was just hard to get to the early squad to film, get to the late squad to film, so no footage from today, but um, me personally didn't bowl very well. Once again, execution is not there. And when you're bowling against the best players in the world on some of the hardest, one of the hardest patterns out there and your execution isn't there, you're just not gonna keep up. They're just too good and you know, that's just, just what it is. But uh, Chris Lawson's bowling A-Squad right now. I think it's about 10.30 maybe. So he'll be done soon. Um, 
I'll try and give you an update after that's done. It may not happen, but we will 8 a.m. tomorrow, so we'll catch you there. We'll try and get some filming done tomorrow for sure, and hopefully we can see some of our own Colorado bowlers make the cut and uh, move on to match play. Um, but we'll catch you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. Alright guys, just got done with my third block of the day, or third block of the week. Um, was way better for the week, I guess. I uh, only missed like six makeables. Still went about 110, 120 under, but you know, it's okay. You gotta learn something when you're competing against the best and you don't got your best game. But if you learn something and know what you need to work on, that was a good week, right? I mean, you didn't cash, but if you're left with some knowledge, that's all you can hope for. But um, we're gonna head out. I'm gonna take a shower, then probably head out and watch some of B-Squad and hope that uh, Chris Lawson can get some comeback and make the cut. But we'll catch up with you guys later. We'll probably show a little bit of match play, a little bit of some shots over there for some random people. We still got like Nick Crumble's close, Brandon Mooney's close, so if we can get some shots of them. We'll see, uh, see how it goes, all right? And we'll catch you guys later. All right, guys, it's Sunday. We're about to head over to the Bowling Center. Top 16 match play. They're in game two right now. We're going to go see if we can see uh, PBA King vlog. You know, Kyle Sherman and Brad Miller win their matches. Brad's still undefeated. Buttrup's also still undefeated. We got some shots of him yesterday, and uh, we'll catch you guys in a little bit. Hey, what's up guys, we made it back from the Masters, uh, I'm tired now, about time to bed, but hope you enjoyed us catching up through the week, um, didn't do very well, but i to see Jacob Usher point it all, which is pretty great, um, make sure if you're new here, you hit that subscribe button, give us a like, let you know if you want to see more of these, alright, 